Hey guys, in this video, I'd like to show you how to share a project on GitHub from Apache NetBeans IDE. I am Nam Haming from CodeJava.net. So, why sharing a project on GitHub? I think the main reasons are for hosting projects code online, sharing projects code publicly, and collaborating with other people. And to follow this video, be sure that you have a GitHub account and a GitHub personal access token. If you don't have a personal access token, I recommend you to follow this video, create and use GitHub personal access token on my YouTube channel. Here are the steps uh, for sharing a project on GitHub from Apache NetBeans IDE. Firstly, you need to create a remote repository on GitHub server and then initialize a local repo for the project and then add the project's files to the index of the local repo and then commit the project files uh, to the local repo and link the local repo with the remote repo and finally post the project files uh, from the local repo to the remote repo firstly you need to sign in the github account and uh, go to the repositories here and create a new uh, repo click the new button here and enter the repository name uh, here I enter the name is code java app and I choose the type is uh, private you can choose public or private uh, depending on the purpose of sharing the project on github and click create a repository here okay so I've got a new uh, report uh, created here and this is the URL URI of the report and also go to the GitHub settings here to uh, ensure that you have a personal access token. Uh, go to developer settings, uh, personal access tokens here. And here you can see I have two personal access tokens. So if you don't have any, you need to generate a new one by clicking the button, uh, generate new token here. Enter the node and choose the scope is a report and click the button uh, generate token okay come back to my uh, uh, report to my github home here and the uh, newly created uh, report here and know that the uri of the report here and this is apache not being study on my computer you see I'm using Apache NetBeans IDE version 12.4 here. And I have a Java project uh, which I want to share it on GitHub. And the next step is to initialize a local repo for this uh, project. So right click on the project name and click versioning initialized git you know, repository here. Or you can also click from the team menu here, team git and initialize uh, repository here and by default uh, the local repository uh, is at the project root as you can see here and click ok and click, click the output here and you see the output of the git command in uh, NetBeans here uh, you know uh, NetBeans uh, has built-in support for git and you can see it executed the command git init here to create a local repo uh, and you can see the dot git directory got created uh, it is the, the local repo of the project and you can see it is under the files here if you don't see the dot git directory here you can open the uh, project directory um, in uh, Windows Explorer and you see the dot git uh, directory created here uh, this is a local uh, repository okay now right click on the project and you can see the context menu git here uh, with various uh, commands uh, for read operations here and the next step is 
to add the project files uh, to the index of the local repo. So click the uh, add uh, command here. And see the output. And you can see this is the uh, output of the read command. It executed the read add command here to add the project files uh, to the index of the local repo. And notice uh, we have the dot read ignore file here. Dot read ignore file that uh, specifies uh, what should not be checked, what should not be under version control. You see, the target directory should not be uh, checked, should not be under version control, should not be uh, pushed uh, to GitHub server. Okay. And the next step is to commit the project files uh, to the local repo. Uh, right click git and you can see the command commit here. And here you can choose what uh, to be uh, committed here. I uh, choose all by default here and enter a commit message. My initial commit. Okay, and click commit and click the output. Uh, here you can see it executed the read commit command here uh, to commit the project files uh, to the local repo. Okay, and then uh, we need to link this, uh, the local repo of this project to the remote repo. So right click on the project read uh, remote and uh, click post here. So we are going to link and also post the project files to the remote repo on GitHub server. And here you need to enter the repository URL uh, which is the uh, uh, URI of the repo on GitHub server github.com here so click this button to copy and paste here okay and then you need to provide your github username and your personal access token here so i enter my github uh, personal access token and check the proxy configuration here to ensure that no proxy okay and click next and choose the uh, um, local branch is the EFO branch master and click next okay so it is going to push the project files from the master branch um, on local to the uh, remote branch origin master on github server and click finish okay done and here you can choose uh, yes uh, to set up uh, the branch master check to the remote branch yes okay so we have done uh, sharing a project uh, on github from apache netbeans and you can see the commands executed in the control here you see uh, read branch read remote read post here it set up stream to origin master here and now let's see uh, in uh, uh, github.com here uh, refresh my report here and you see i got my initial commit here the project files here you see let me see uh, java source file you see So you have learned how to share a project on GitHub from Apache NetBeans IDE. I hope you have found this video helpful. Please subscribe to my channel, like, comment, and share this video. Thanks for watching.